Due to perennial flooding emergencies in Nigeria, the National Executive Council NEC, chaired by Vice President Kashim Shatima, has taken a proactive step by approving the provisions of insurance coverage for states nationwide. The insurance is intended to serve as a protective measure against disasters, offering a safety net for both citizens and farmers, including both large and small scale agricultural operators. There are more details in this next report. According to the 2023 annual flood outlook put together by Nigeria's Hydrological Service Agency, states with high agricultural output fall within the high probable flood risks areas, which suggest food insecurity if nothing is done. In order to stem the tide of disasters occasioned by excessive rain and flood, the National Executive Council has collaborated with a leading insurance company in Africa to provide insurance coverage designed to safeguard against the consequences of natural disasters. Disasters. There was a present the the Africa you also made an a presentation on crop insurance, which can help our teaming farmers, pastoralists, and those small scale holders to obtain insurance so that they protect it will protect against disasters, catastrophes or challenges that can be faced from uh, time to time in agricultural production. In addition to instituting insurance coverages for states, the committee further took a crucial step by establishing management councils dedicated to ensuring effective responses to flood disasters throughout the country. The establishment of National Flood Management Council to be domiciled in the office of the Vice President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Upon advice from this council to Mr. President, depending on the magnitude of the flood, especially if it is category four, then Mr. President will declare state of emergency. Funding options. We recommended annual budget for both state, federal, and local government, ecological fund for both state and federal government, Natural Resource Development Fund, Special Intervention Funds, Disaster and Emergency. Recognizing the existing challenges within the healthcare sector, the Council is creating a platform where state governors can reaffirm their dedication to addressing and amending the issues prevalent in the sector. Looked at all the problems and challenges of health sector, uh, from financing, from the human capital, from the supervisory point of view, and even from the leadership level, from the presidency to the local government, and the need for us as governors, as local government, and even as you media, to put interest in health sector. Because without the health sector being taken care of, we may not even have the now artificial intelligence, even the inner intelligence that we need. Stanton is looking at us in the eye, and definitely we are drifting as a nation. So there was even a resolution of council that the WHO is coming in December 15th. While efforts are being made as a safety net for citizens, the federal government also announced the 50% subsidy on agricultural input for farmers as part of the upcoming dry season farming initiative to support the agricultural sector. Tamilore Akinkoli at TV360 Lagos.